Hi there, Stephen Pegg. Thanks for watching our videos. Do appreciate it. As always, we'd love for you to subscribe below. Hit the subscribe button below and also the bell notification button below. That way you'll know when we put up future videos. Uh, Pegg's actually kind of surprised me with a, a brand new phone. I've needed one for probably a year now. Uh, and she's surprising me with a brand new phone. Um, I will tell you right now that my son is an iOS developer and he always gets the brand new iPhones when they come out. And then after he gets the iPhones, his old one goes to the boys, and the boys have a battle to figure out who's got the newest phone of all. I have the newest phone of all now. I can't open it yet. She's not going to let me open it, but I do get to go stop at the Verizon store and get it. And we'll probably unbox it here in the next week or so uh, when I get a case for it. So we're going to go to the Verizon store, and then we're going to head over to Kohl's. But I'm going to stop and get my brand new phone first. So yeah, hang tight, and we'll head over to Verizon, and then over to Kohl's. I officially have a brand new phone. Um, we just picked it up from the Verizon store, so I officially have a brand new phone. Peg is not letting me open it. I, I can't open it until I get a case, so we'll be doing an unboxing video on that. The one I've got right now is almost seven years old. I've replaced the battery three times. I get a new iPhone. Can you imagine how jealous my kids are going to be now that I have the newest iPhone? We're actually going over to Kohl's right now. I've not been into Kohl's since before the pandemic started. Peg and I used to go to Kohl's probably once a month just to get different things because they have Kohl's cash and they have different deals and it's, it, they have great prices on a lot of things. But we've not been into Kohl's since before the pandemic. Peg has bought some stuff from Kohl's online to have delivered to the house and she's gotten Kohl's cash that way. Well, she forgot that she got Kohl's cash emailed to her from stuff that she bought uh, earlier this month that expired, what, three, four days ago? So we're going to go into Kohl's, actually go into Kohl's and see if there's any way that we can still use the Kohl's cash. So let's go get parked and, and head out into Kohl's again. We haven't been here in a long time, so I want to see what Kohl's is all about. So one of the things they've done here at Kohl's is they've closed uh, one of the entrances. They have two entrances here. Uh, one of them is closed, and they're only letting people in the one entrance. So we're going to wander down that way and go in that entrance. Clearance on winter stuff already? Yeah, well, clearance on winter stuff already, gloves and stuff. That's surprising. But then again, I think they're trying to get it. They've got back stock like you wouldn't believe because of the pandemic, so I, I can understand a little bit of that. A lot that's white and yeah they have uh, social distancing markers all across the floor they even have a sign up that lets you know approximately how long you're going to be waiting if you're this far from the checkout they uh, do have halloween stuff here at least this spot 50 percent or 40 percent off depending on so they do have some halloween stuff here You need a new belt. I do need a new belt, actually. Thinking of that, I do need a new belt. Buy one, get one half off. Too bad I don't need two belts. I only need one. Uh, too bad I can't read. I don't have sizes. I can't see sizes. I checked out her Kohl's cash, and even though that it was outdated, it, they said it was still good for, what, another 10 days, honey? And uh, so I'm going to get belts on our coal cash because I need a belt. And we've picked out a couple here, um, one for me and one for my son because we're both the same size. One of the things I do like about Kohl's is they got pretty much everything you need, uh, except for groceries. Um, you want kitchen stuff, they got it here. You want shoes, they got it here. Uh, they also have a, 
Oh, you want a Cuisinart? They got Keurigs and you know that stuff here as well. Uh, Instapots. I don't know how to use an Instapot, but everybody talks about Instapots. Um, I might have to do a little research on Instapots. One of the things I do like about Kohl's is they have a big and tall section, albeit not the biggest big and tall section in the world, but I like looking at the big and tall because I'm 6'2", and a lot of times I can find a good deal in here um, on shirts and things like that. So I'm going to take a quick peek and see what they got. Especially on the clearance rack back here. See if they've got anything that hasn't been picked over in a long time. Oh, that's good. That is a good shirt. How much is that going to be? Oh, too much. Ooh. It's 33. 80% off. That's uh -huh. the clearance price is 33? Yes, and you get another 20% off on top of it. Wow. I'm not going to pay that kind of money for that. I can find cheaper. Yeah, that would be the only shirt. I mean, there's a lot of shirts in here. I don't like these kind of shirts. I like I like these kind of shirts, to be honest with you, but I'm not paying $33 for a shirt that I might be able to get two weeks from now for 20 I think I'll tell you that I'm a clothes horse in the family. Ooh. Too bad it's a large. That's a marble shirt. Look at that. That's a marble shirt, honey. I want to see if they've got another one of those. I collect Disney shirts. I don't collect marble shirts. i got to remember that. I see a cool shirt, and I'm just like, oh, wait a minute. It's not Disney. I can't get it. And they don't have any over on this side. No. All right. Well, I'm done looking here because they don't have anything I lie. You want those head pillows? Frozen. Frozen. The sky's awake, so I'm awake. There you go. Get that for your kid. There's no price tag on it. Oh, yeah, there is. How much is this thing? 25 bucks. No. There's your Roomba, honey. We have an iRobot. My son got it for us uh, for Christmas a couple of years ago. One of these uh, Roomba robots. And I think it could get used once a month because Peg doesn't like it. Hey, look at this. For my Keurig. And we have a Keurig at home. We just haven't opened it yet. They have uh, Swiss Miss Cocoa. They have... Uh, oh, this is a... Uh, that's a uh, flavor. Classic cinnamon roll coffee. There's the Food Ninja. I've heard about the Food Ninja. There's that, uh, that's the uh, air fryer. Again, something I've not tried. And remember the George Foreman grills. George Foreman grills, yeah. <laughs> I still see the infomercial every now and then for that uh, on late night television. Break out, honey. What? We need to break out our Mickey waffle maker because our Mickey waffle maker is so much cooler than this. Even though that's a Cuisinart, a Cuisinart our Mickey waffle maker is so much cooler than that. Oh, well, there, there's your crock pot. That's an express crock pot. Ooh, that's something new. I will have to see what that is all about. It's, it's a mini crock pot, yeah. Then they've got the big one up here. That's look at all. It's all computerized now. I just remember pushing the button and setting a dial for 350 or no, I'm sorry, simmer, medium, and high. Now it's all computerized. What is that? It looks like a air, is that a, well, is that air a, fryer. I'm gonna say, is that a mini microwave? No, it's like an air fryer. Here, open it it's up. It's an ultimate fryer oven. You wave. You can't. Oh, you can't open it's it up? It's a demo. Wow. That's got to be the air fryer. Yeah, it's a digital air fryer, yep. 
and that's the ultimate air fryer oven, and that's a digital air fryer. So I heard the air fryer is supposed to be really good. Uh, I have had people that have had it. It's one of the things I sort of want, but I don't really want it because I really don't have room on my countertops. You know, normally we come to Kohl's for clothes, and I've never really come back here into this appliance section, but they got some cool stuff back here. There's another Ninja. Uh, this one's a Ninja grill. And another air fryer over here. This is a uh, Cuisinart. Oh, KitchenAid mixers. We have, we have the big one. We have a five quart. Yeah. And KitchenAid mixers is like the hottest thing right now. Um, they usually do go on sale during the holidays. So you can always wait during the holidays. They are, they are on sale at Costco sometimes and then i think sam sometimes i think there was one special going on just keep watch of the pricing they should run about they should run you about 199 to 249 and you remember you just want the bigger the better if you can on these because you even though you think you may want the smaller one the 4.5 quart you never know when you want to do a double batch of cookies what is the price on these anyway there's got to be a price tag on them here these are these are running 379 but so. there's a sale but they don't have it right now yeah Mm -hmm. oh, that's a mixer mm -hmm. mixers oh there's a ninja we've got one of those and i'll tell you what if you want to make strawberry daiquiris uh, there you go we had a friend come up from florida show us how to make perfect strawberry daiquiris with these things and then they laughed at us and we did finally get a ninja last year it's a, it's a mixer that we got when we got married 30 years ago honey and that's when we found out how to make really really good strawberry daiquiris You got a whole bunch of pots and pans. We actually got pots and pans from Costco we haven't opened up yet that we need to do. And we'll do an unboxing video. Which ones are these? Epic deals. Don't know what they are. They're called Food Network. This is new. No coupons needed. Huh. Interesting. Let's see. It comes with an 8 inch skillet, 10 inch skillet, 1.5 quart saucepan with lid, 2.2 quart, 3 quart, and 6 quart. Hmm. 79 bucks. And then you have the good stuff. Yeah, and here I thought we were done with cookware, but I guess not. We found this as we were walking to the another part of the store. These are how much? These are expensive, a little bit more expensive. Yeah, the, the skillet itself, the skillet. It's right here. 79.99. Better be a darn good skillet. It is a good skillet. It all, it all has to do with basically how long it lasts and the core at the bottom. And we got more pots and pans back here. They actually have a really big kitchen section at uh, Kohl's. Um, again, I normally don't wander back here. We normally come in here for clothes and not for uh, kitchen stuff. But they have a really, really big kitchen section in Kohl's. So we're gonna walk out. Um, I just gonna get the belt while we're here. Like I say, we normally come to Kohl's for clothes, but the fitting rooms are closed, so you can't really try on anything right now. And I'm really not wanting to buy anything, take it home, try it on, bring it back if it doesn't fit. So, I mean, everybody knows that Kohl's has great deals on clothing. Um, but again, if you can't try it on, I'd rather wait, or like Peg does, buy it online, have it sent to the house, and. And send it back if it doesn't fit. But they do have some great deals up here. I love their clearance racks. Oh, look at that. How much is that? Four dollars and twenty cents. Look what at size, that. What size is that? Small. That'll fit. Andy'd never wear that. Even no, if I, I didn't it want to fit it, no. Yeah. Andy would never wear that. As we wrap things up at Kohl's today, I, a lot of times I'll wander through the clothing aisle. We really didn't, except for maybe a little bit of big and tall. But when I go to Kohl's, before the pandemic, uh, we would spend a lot of time in the clearance racks because they have some great deals in the clearance racks here. But uh, today I just wanted to get in. Peg wanted to do her Kohl's cash and make sure she got her Kohl's cash uh, working because she it expired on her. And they said that she could. Um, and we did use her Kohl's cash. But we actually spent a little bit of time in the kitchen section, which we've not done in a long time. Normally it's just the clearance racks and the clothing sections that we go to Kohl's. Uh, but... 
and we got through the clearance or we got through the uh, the kitchen section found some cool stuff in there as well but i did get my kohl's cash i did get the belt that i needed because i needed a new belt but uh, again we hadn't been to kohl's probably since before the pandemic started it was interesting to go back in the store and see that not a lot of people in there to be honest with you um, wrapping things up so we're done we appreciate you watching our videos as always love for you to hit the subscribe button below love for you to hit the bell notification button below and we'd love for you to hit the like button as well thanks for watching